Uh, Minister, given that we have the world's longest non-militarized border with the U.S., closing Roxham Road or suspending the safe third country agreement would not be a solution. It would just cause asylum seekers to make more dangerous crossing and put them uh, at a greater risk of exploitation. You have suggested modernization, modern, modernizing the agreement to make it more sustainable. Could you share with us what modernizing the agreement might look like? Um, look, thank you uh, to my colleague for the question. And, and I think it's you, you've made a key point. Uh, a simple suspension of the safe third country agreement, uh, in my view, would lead to uh, a potentially significant number of people uh, making claims in, in a different uh, and perhaps less organized way that would uh, exacerbate some of the challenges that are very real uh, of dealing with large numbers of people who seek to come across our borders. Um, despite the scale of our challenges, I should point out as well, uh, we sometimes forget that we're blessed by geography compared to many countries in the world surrounded by three oceans and uh, the United States to our southern border, which limits the number of people who seek to come in irregularly compared to other countries. Uh, that said, because we want to maintain uh, this uh, this uh, unmilitarized uh, border with our largest and most important geopolitical partner, uh, we need to work together to make sure that the uh, the system works more effectively. Uh, you'll forgive me if I don't go into the uh, specifics of uh, what a modernized agreement looks like, because of course we're having discussions in real time with the United States, and it would betray the confidence that they have uh, uh, shared with us as a result of these conversations being in an uh, uh, ongoing way. Uh, uh, so I. I won't uh, uh, share the details of those discussions on an open floor when they were uh, promised in confidence to the United States. Uh, however, we're going to seek to make sure uh, we continue to promote regular migration, uh, discourage people from making uh, perilous journeys, and ensure that on both sides of the border, people are treated with compassion and have a fair shot to have their asylum claim heard uh, should they uh, uh, land in one country or the other and choose to make an asylum claim to seek safe haven.